Hello, Colonial Woods Church. I am Pastor Dan, and as always, this is my good friend, Pastor Ann, uh, coming up with our midweek update. Ann, have you had a good week so far? I've had a pretty good week so far. I uh, can't complain. Staying busy, and uh, the sun's out, so really, how can you complain? I mean, you're outside enjoying the nice weather. I'm I came out. Yeah, I decided to come outside, give a little different scenery than the back of my living room, um, and so instead we get to see my neighbor's house. I didn't get permission, um, but, you know, I think he'll be okay with it. Uh, we should be good. Uh, but we are coming live from our home still, I think, on quarantine day number 523. Um, start, I feel like it's like a Star Trek episode, you know, like Star Date, 1.257. Uh, <laughs> it feels like it's in the hundreds. I think it's in the 20s, but okay. Yeah, probably only the 20s. But, um, but we are here with our midweek update, and, and we have some things we want to share with our, our team, our people, um, some things that are coming up, right? We do, yeah. Um, in fact, the first thing we want to talk about is um, a new thing on our website about uh, how to get connected to Zoom links and things like that. And I think maybe if you could do that. Yeah, we've had several of you kind of comment. It might have been a little tough to find all the different things we're having, like the Zoom link specifically. So um, we're going to try some new technology. Um, we're branching out here because we're high tech. Um, but if you go to our website, which is cwmc.church, um, once you get to the website, it should be popping up on your screen here in a second. Once you get to our website, then you're going to scroll out not very far, and there'll be this like orange little banner that talks about all the stuff going on. But there's going to be a little thing that says online events, online events. And so it's right there. Once you click on that online events, it's going to give you all the live links uh, for our Zoom and all the different things we have. And so you'll see our prayer awakening our virtual online youth group and all the different things and that's where you're going to find our events hopefully in one spot so if you've been looking for different things you kind of know where it's at so the two that i want to highlight today are our prayer meeting which is at 7 p.m tonight 7 p.m tonight you can find on there if you're interested in that and then also our virtual youth group we've been having fun we had 89 people last week pastor ann wow um, great youth group um, which was awesome and that starts at 6 p.m Okay, that sounds great. And so that is our new spot to find anything. And we're going to be continuing to direct people to that. Online events will get you to anything that we have a link for. So I thought that was kind of neat of our creative arts department to come up with a one place stop where we can get everybody connected. Um, yeah, that's why we call them creative. You that's know, why we they're, call them creative. Yeah, they do a good job. This week, um, it is, uh, we're in the week leading up to Easter. And so Friday is Good Friday. And we typically have a Good Friday service in our community, and that is still going to happen. Uh, it's going to be online at 1 o'clock on Friday. It's going to be hosted at Colonial Woods, but it's going to be um, as far as where we tape it. But it's actually going to be hosted online on the Operation Transformation Facebook page. So you go to Operation Transformation, and at 1 o'clock, that will start live on their page. And so that's the beginning of kind of the services for, for Easter with the Good Friday. And then, uh, well, then we have Easter, Dan. That, that's kind Yeah, of Easter, um, that's an exciting time. We're still going to celebrate. Just because uh, Corona's around doesn't mean we end Easter. And so we're going to still be here on Sunday morning. Our normal service times, 9 and 1045. I know sometimes we've done three services, but when we're online, we don't need to. So 9 a.m. and 1045 is going to be a great time for you to show up for Easter Sunday, um, after you found your Easter basket, is you found, you're gonna find yours, right, Ann? Yeah, no, I, I haven't had an Easter basket in a number of years, Dan. Oh. Um, so, uh, it's, uh, <laughs> we are gonna have some <laughs> cool elements to the Easter service that haven't been a part of every week. So I'm really okay. looking forward to what we're gonna be doing. But um, Dan, let me ask you, like, um, I would say that maybe we've dressed a little more casually uh, the last few weeks online. Uh, what are you thinking? Did you get some new Easter clothes? Um, did you have some Amazon deliver some? Or are you looking forward uh, not, to that? Not yet, but that may have to happen. Uh, my mom always told me growing up that you got to wear a tie on Easter. Um, and so I, I, there's a good chance I'm going to be wearing a tie on our little pre-show um, wow. on, on Sunday morning. Uh, and you're wearing your prom dress from high school. Is that what I heard? <laughs> yeah, no. I am oh. dressing up. I am dressing up. I have a specific outfit already picked out for Easter Sunday that's very Easter colored because uh, it's a special day. I mean, we're, you know, even though we're in the midst of this, we're celebrating the risen Savior and that is a big deal. And so it is a, it's a, going to be a great day. And um, so you might want to tune in people that we're going to be maybe a little bit 
dress nicer. Hey, I got an idea. Yeah. What if we challenge our people to dress up as well? I know that typically it's nice coming to church in your pajamas, but what if everybody got dressed up and then they took pictures and sent them into us that we could maybe show the next week? Yeah. Um, and so you can dress up on Easter Sunday. And so uh, let's do that. Uh, if you guys want to join us um, dressing up on Easter Sunday so you kind of feel like you're still at church, do that. Take a picture of your family. You can do it in front of the TV, even with us on the screen um, in the background because we're going to look good. Uh, and uh, then send that in. You can email it to us or just put on social media and hashtag CWMC and uh, we'll find that. But that'd be kind of a cool idea. That sounds like a great idea. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing those pictures. It's been fun seeing what people are sending us. So yeah. uh, last kind of a few things we want to talk about this midweek update is uh, just a reminder about our daily content um, on our website, on our Facebook page. There is a grid that gives all of the uh, weekly content, but just a reminder on Mondays and Fridays, there's a, a weekly encouragement message from one of our staff members. On Tuesday mornings, uh, I do a Bible study online um, that you're welcome to join. And also Wednesday, Pastor Phil um, is uh, gives a message to our congregation. And uh, so those are just some of the fun things that are on there every week, something new. We're trying to keep fresh content out there for you, uh, keep you encouraged and remind you that while we're in the midst of this, God is still in control and he's still a, a God who has, he's not surprised by any of this and he's taking care of us. We always want to remind you of that. Um, and, uh, you know, as always, Dan and I will be with you at uh, uh, 15 minutes before the services uh, to do our pre-show. And um, that's got, it's become a life of its own, but we're looking forward to you joining us for that. Dan, uh, is there anything else you think you want to say before we leave? Um, I, I know what it is. You've got some smart remarks for me, don't you? Well, you know, I had heard uh, that you are really good at drawing self-portrait selfies of yourself. Um, and, I, and I thought that maybe uh, on Sunday people could chime in and you would send them an autographed self-portrait selfie of yourself to anybody who needs one on Sunday. Um, you know, I, you've really got to start working on better sources because wherever <laughs> you're hearing stuff, they're not telling you the truth. Um, it's all yeah, up here. I know. It's all <laughs> up here. I'll tell you what, though, I will, if for, if for any requests, just, I'm thinking that I will, I won't draw anything, but I will autograph one of my business cards and send it off. <laughs> there you go. That's what all I'm going right, to this time. I'll have you sign my business card and then it'll be worth it. <laughs> Mine will actually be worth something. Okay. <laughs> so right, well, I think I that's think all we've done. I think though, we've right? done all we can. Yeah. So, um, so other than that, we hope you have a great week and we'll see you guys all later. Okay. Sounds good. See ya. Bye-bye.